Hello to everyone and welcome here at Lighted. My name is Mauro Persechino. I'm the business developer for the industry market here. And today I will uh, show you what Lighted is doing and what Lighted has done for terahertz imaging. Let's start with a short introduction about us. Lighted was founded six years ago by Pierre Jolie and Jean Charles Roche. Uh, starting from uh, interactions and collaborations with very important labs in Paris, uh, with the, the goal and the ambition to bring state-of-the-art technology in the terrors and in the infrared from the scientific lab to the industry. Uh, it was not as, uh, it was not an easy task because terrors technologies were not so developed at the moment. But still, since terrorist radiation is very interesting, it is, for example, non-ionizing, which means that it's safe for health, safe for biological tissues. Uh, it penetrates non-metal and non-polar materials. It is sensitive to water content. All these features are very important to non-destructive testing. This is why we put a lot of efforts in it, and we started developing components and systems in this domain. Today, I will mainly focus on high resolution real time imaging for non destructive testing. Let's start with a simple example a real time scan of a plastic box. This is just to highlight the real time quality of our system. You can see the visible uh, part with, uh, with an usual camera and then the terrace image close to it. But how can we apply this to the real world? For example, if you take into account the pharma industry, uh, maybe you want to uh, see what's inside your packaging without chemically interact with your pills, for example. This uh, is what you can achieve with terrorists. You can easily see that the first two locations are empty and the second two are full. But applications are so many and they're increasing in number as terrorist features are acknowledged by the community. So for example, agri-food, uh, because of the water content sensitivity, you can see anomalies in biological tissues. Then you can also see through the, the plastic packaging, what's inside directly the, the packaging, you can spot uh, external object in your uh, production chain among food, um, but also ceramic is transparent to uh, to terra earths. Uh, you can see through ceramic. This is very important, for example, for uh, the art and heritage uh, community. You can see what's inside a vase that you cannot open, for example. Uh, but uh, the real features of our system uh, can be highlighted by this uh, real-time video. So you can see that it's real-time with a rate acquisition rate of five Earths. Can, you can also see the resolution. The ball, it's, it has one millimeter diameter. So you can see that we go at higher, higher resolutions with respect to this, uh, to this ball. Uh, then here, using the transparency uh, of foam with terrors, you can see metal objects inside an opaque foam. This, those two last examples can be relevant for counterfeiting or security, for example. So uh, what we bring to the community is that for the first time you have real-time terrors imaging. And since other uh, systems or already existing systems have resolutions of the order of one millimeter, we can go beyond this and uh, with our resolution of 300 migrants. Then you can customize your system more or less as you want. We, uh, we offer up to five different frequencies from two to five, uh, five terahertz. You can choose transmission or reflection configuration and everything will be always fully automated and user-friendly. Uh, those tests have been performed with 2.5 terahertz source uh, to highlight the high resolution, but we can also offer different frequencies. For example, if you want to go deeper, 
and see what's below the surface, you can use lower frequencies. And as you can see in the bottom part, uh, bottom right, actually, uh, of, the, of this slide, it's easy to see the microchip, the electronical chip inside the metal card by using a lower frequency. We can basically modify all our systems because we are capable to develop all the components that you need from the source to the detector passing through the components in the parahertz. Then we also have other items in the, in the infrared, but let's not talk about that now. Uh, we basically can do whatever we want in the terrorists. This leads us to the final slide and to the epic questions. What can we do for you? Uh, what can you do for us? Well, what we can do for you is to give you a new pair of eyes to see the world at a different wavelength, which means that with our know-how and expertise, we can provide solutions to you as the recently discussed high resolution real-time terrorist imaging but not only uh, terrorist imaging also spectroscopy radar what can you do for us is to point us to the right direction to the problems that matter to you your challenges and we'll try to answer with a solution uh, if you want to discuss if you have questions if you just want to know more about us uh, please contact me or the sales team at the following uh, addresses and uh, we will try uh, to give you answers and solutions. Uh, that's all from Paris. Uh, wish you to do business with you quite soon and goodbye.